Hey everybody, NavyDoc5184 here and welcome to another music reaction and today we are reacting to the winner of my uh, tournament that I had on who to react to that hasn't been reacted to in a while. So we are going to react to David Bowie and I'm going to react to his uh, Starman performance from Top of the Pops. So um, I don't know why I haven't re uh, reacted to Bowie lately. I mean, he's such a great artist. I mean, he spans so many genres that it's like... He's got something for everybody, so I honestly don't know why I really uh, haven't really paid much attention to him. But um, hopefully this will be the start of the rectification of that. But um, we're just going to go ahead and get started. I will leave a link to the original video in the description below. Let's go ahead and get this thing started. Alright, so I think I know this song, but I'm not positive. I'm sure as I listen on to it more, I'll know whether I have or not. I'll say this, if I haven't heard it, I already really like it. So I've already commented about how I can already tell I'm going to like this song. I, I think I've heard it. It does sound familiar. Um, but like I said, even if I haven't heard it before, it uh, definitely sounds like something I would dig. I mean, he definitely got some soul in his voice, but it's got like a nice rock pop sound to it despite the fact that he's thrown in some like soul in there it feels like but boy i tell you what man his look it it feels like with every song i've done he's had a different look and it's like he rocks them all so well it's just it's crazy how he pulls this off makes it work and it's like it seems like it's kind of out there but at the same time it's not like put offish if you know what i mean but, um, geez, this guy is just something else, man. Talk about, like, an ultimate showman. Then the loud sound, it seemed to fade. It came back like a slow mm -hmm. voice on a wave of things. That was no DJ, that was Hazy Cosmic Jive. I'm not entirely sure, but I really love the chord progression of this song. There's a song oh, yup. I do know this. <laughs> All right. Oh wow. Guy, I'm not even gonna lie. I got thrown off for a second because when I saw the bass player and looked at him, for some reason, I thought that was John Deacon. It threw me off so bad. I'm just like, wait, Deacon? What's he? Uh, but then it's like my senses kind of caught to me real quick. But good Lord Almighty, it just threw me off so bad, like. To the point where I was kind of starting to lose concentration on the song. That's how bad it threw me off so that. But, I mean, holy cow. But, yes, so I have heard this song before. Only bits and pieces of it. So I'm actually kind of glad I'm doing this one. Really, uh, the, I know it feels like every time I listen to Bowie, I feel like it's kind of like um, like a new favorite Bowie song. But um, I feel like it's about to do that again. It, this is probably going to be way high up there. I'm loving everything about it. I mean, the vocals, the chord progression, everything. Just how he got everything set up. It's just, it's like, it's such a beautiful song. I love it. I love it. And I'll say this, the harmonies are on point too. Oh, that's some pretty smooth guitar playing right there too. Nice and simple. It does exactly what it needs to do. Get it, Dave. Okay, so I, I feel like there's got to be some story behind this song. You know, it's just like, 
either that or he's just that freaking artistic, which is a very strong possibility as well. But I feel like there is some sort of story behind this song. And I know those of you who are my David Bowie aficionados, if you could in the comments, if you know any backstory behind the song, please, 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 please leave that in the comments because that's got me very curious it feels like there's actually some sort of story that's being told with it so if any of y'all have any info please leave them in the comments talking about blowing our minds I wonder if David's talking by himself with like maybe an older generation. <laughs> and I'm sure David Bowie blew up a lot of minds back in the day. <laughs> it's amazing how such a slow paced song is so, like it feels so fun you know what I mean feels like you have a lot of fun with this song yet yeah, it's kind of like a slower pace alright y'all well I gotta say I am uh, really glad um, Bowie won that up uh, poll uh grant i know the other two people i had on there saluna and queen i will probably react to them at some point but um after listening to that song i'm really really kind of missing doing my date or my david bowie reactions because he has so much work and a lot of it's so good but what's great about bowie is he like ranges all genres so it's like if you like rock pop r&b soul blues whatever there's something in David Bowie's catalog for you. It's like he touches on everything and it's very rare to find amongst people. So thanks for stopping by and I'll catch y'all down the road.